You know, being the 74th governor of North Carolina has been a privilege and an honor. But during this wonderful season, it's also time to celebrate our democratic process and respect what I see to be the ultimate outcome of the closest North Carolina governor's race in modern history. Despite continued questions that should be answered regarding the voting process, I personally believe that the majority of our citizens have spoken and we now should do everything we can to support the 75th governor of North Carolina, Roy Cooper. The McCrory administration team will assist in every way to help the new administration make a smooth transition. You know, while exhibiting the highest of ethical standards, I am proud that our team leaves the state a much better place than when we came into office. Now, during my remaining weeks as governor, this team will be focusing on developing a financial plan to be approved in a special legislative session to help our citizens and communities impacted by Hurricane Matthew and by the current wildfires in the western region of our state. I ask all of us to please pray for our new governor, Roy Cooper, our new president, Donald Trump, and their families. And I encourage everyone, now more than ever, to respect all of our public servants and the offices they were elected to hold. Thank you for the honor to serve the great state of North Carolina.